last English lesson of the week. It's similar to your previous lesson this week, lesson seven, in that I am just giving you vocab and then audiobook, but I mean, there are some questions embedded in this Edpuzzle as well. But the chapter is even a little bit shorter than last lesson. Uh, because I want to make sure you have time to edit your play manuscript because the final draft is due at 12 on Friday. Um, 7A and 7B, this needs this definitely needs to be done. <laughs> uh, 7C, this still is attendance part three for you, um, but it's less of an emergency if you didn't get it done today because you still have two days before Friday at 12, but you still must email me if you're not finished with your play manuscript final draft. Otherwise I have to mark you deviated, deviated from the lesson. So just keep in contact. All right, vocab, you ready? Vocab chapter eight, write down the ones you don't know. Stratagem, stratagem. The same as strategy or a plan. Easy peasy. It's Latin. Peddler. This is the American spelling with two D's and an E. This is the British spelling. Peddler, peddler. It's someone who walks around selling things. So this is a peddler right here. One image. The etymology, I looked it up and it's related to the French word for foot, pied. It's like an anglicized version of PA, someone who walks around on foot selling stuff. Peddler. Oh, same with pedestrian, for example. Pedestrian is related to French PA. Pedestrian is someone who is walking. Simple, obviously you know what simple means, but in the book today, it means foolish. Like it's kind of an older meaning. Like, yeah, you know, simple means enkel, but uh, did you know that if you call someone Simple, you're actually calling them foolish or dumb. <laughs> Jinn, this is from mythology. It's like genies in ancient Arabian, like pre-Islamic and then Islamic fol folklore. So here's one very old document, drawings of the Jinn people. And here's a very new rendition of a genie but today in today's chapter you find out that the white witch is part jinn part actually lilith lil lilith is supposedly her name in according to some mythology she was the first wife of adam but she's not actually mentioned in the judeo christian bible so i'm not i'm not quite sure there but Mythological witch creature. That's what she is. <laughs> oh, that was it. Ah! Expressions. Time out of mind. As long as anyone can remember. I would never say time out of mind. I would say time immemorial. That's a little bit more common nowadays, I feel. Time out of mind. Mark my words. I would, I would say this. This is common. Pay attention. Remember what I'm saying. Mark my words. This shall come to pass. This shall happen. I'll, I'll say I told you so. That was it. Ha! Study for a wee bit. And um, just a reminder to email me if you're not finished with your play manuscript today. What else? I swear there was something else. Uh, have a great day. Have a great weekend. Have a great life. Bye.